let's take a look at our completed system. Here's our manifold. We have the ground on it. Four lines. And let's just follow them. Here we have the hookup for the dryer. Here we have our hookup for the hot water tank. Now like I said again, I like to run hard pipe from the hot water tank up to the ceiling. So the CSST is not nylon and been air there. Here we have the hookup for the furnace. And most of this is already here. And I'm okay with this hanging down like that. Because it's up in the air. It's not that low to the ground where a, a child will grab it or anything like that. So I'm okay with that. But you can go either way on that. You can run it up to the ceiling or run it down to your furnace. But I do like to run hard pipe out of the furnace and then hook the CSST to that. Here is our oven hookup. And I like to run the black iron through the floor. I know they have uh, floor flanges, but not for me. I like to run it into black iron and then up through the floor into the kitchen. So I have that hard pipe going through the floor with uh, no connections, no CSSD connections uh, hanging in the wall or somewhere where it's not accessible. Here is our our range hookup, and you can see where we came up through the floor with the black iron pipe, and we do not have a flange in here. I like having the black iron pipe here, and then into your valve, and then into the oven with your black slide. I don't like using those floor flanges, because I can get that pipe right up against the wall there, and, and I, I just trust that a lot more than the floor flange. So there I have it, a completed CSST uh, system, and I kind of installed it, you know, how I like to do it.